Tom Hardy's Venom 3 sneak peek photo sparks speculation of a Spider-Man crossover. The impending Venom 3 film has MCU fans thrilled, especially after Tom Hardy released a recent set shot. The image indicates an intriguing link to Spider-Man No Way Home, raising questions about the premise of the new Venom film. In the photo, Hardy, resuming his role as Eddie Brock, Venom, is shown wearing the same attire he wore in the post credit scene of Venom, Let There Be Carnage and his brief appearance in Spider-Man No Way Home. The choice of clothing, a button-up shirt paired with a Golden State Warriors t-shirt, is more than just a style choice. The image suggests that Venom 3 picks up directly following Eddie Brock's brief appearance in the Marvel Cinematic Universe, where he was transported across universes. Fans are now wondering about the significance of Brock's unchanging attire, which appears worn and in need of a wash, implying a probable aftermath of his interdimensional excursion. The anticipation for a fight between Tom Hardy's Venom and Tom Holland's Spider-Man grows. While there has been no confirmation of such a crossover, the common reality of Sony's Spider-Man reality, and the MCU keeps the potential alive. Venom has a minimal role in Spider-Man No Way Home, with Eddie Brock spending the majority of his time in a pub studying about the heroes of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Co-writer Chris McKenna said that earlier drafts of the film contained a larger role for Venom, even putting him in the climactic Statue of Liberty battle alongside other villains. Despite the excitement, these ideas were put on hold, leaving fans wanting more interactions between the characters. The actors and crew are noticeably excited as Venom 3 nears the end of its production phase. Juno Temple, who joins the franchise for this installment, expressed her excitement for the project during the SAG Awards Gala. She emphasized the excitement of working on such a large-scale picture and stated her desire for the viewers to witness the conclusion.